We bring to you the best Nollywood movie and African entertainment to your home. Stay tuned and subscribe to our channel for latest movie updates. We care about your happiness. Thank you for watching A to Z TV Nori. God bless you. Reserved love. <laughs> okay, okay, you win. No, honestly, I can you go win. on and oh, okay. on you and win. on uh, and on uh, and. Uh, and uh, okay, okay, let's go again. Can you see there's this car that has been following us? Why not allow it to pass? No, but the road is uh, wide enough for it. So can you see the car, the blue car? Can you see? Good. What is this guy driving? Shoot that. Put on your seatbelt.
Mike, you won't believe it. A mysterious snake just saved my life. The snake emerged from nowhere and attacked the robbers. <laughs> it's like a fairy tale to me. It's like a script from a fantasy picture. This can be happening. <laughs> the guy is gone, but thank God I'm still alive. Oh, wait, listen, they wanted to kill me. They almost got me down. They wanted to waste my life. Not again. This can be happening. Okay, okay, okay. Mike, I I'll see you tomorrow in the office, okay? Oh, it was like a scene in a Hollywood movie. Thank God you survived. <laughs> Those niggas would have blown your head off, man. But are you, are you telling me all through the whole thing, um, the cops didn't come, no one called the cops? Cops? Hey, shh. Hey, don't say I told you. Some things do not exist here in this part of the country. They will not come even when you call them. Damn. <laughs> Yeah, man, this country is crazy, man. Yeah, what is it? Sir, do you mean we'll make the supply to Amazon Bank? Jimmy, what sort of question is that? Sir, the check for the last supply of the computer accessories is still lying on the desk. I see. But did you put a call across to the um, AGM? Uh, sir, I did, but what he was saying is not encouraging. He was saying they will pay in 30 days' time from now. 30 days' time? You could just give me a few minutes, let me finish with one friend, okay? Okay, sir. Good, Good day, sir. How are you doing? You doing alright? Fine, sir. Uh, that's uh, Jimmy, my manager. Jimmy, my, my bosom friend. He's based in states, but he has a lot of companies here in the country. Okay, right here. <laughs> how you doing? It's a pleasure, sir. Thank you. How you doing, man? Fine, sir. You cool? Yeah, it's fine. Nice. I appreciate people who stay abroad and still visit home for business. <laughs> well, we remember our country, but the important thing is, does the country remember us? Hey, 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 hey. you're making a lot of bucks here. Yeah. Oh, shut up. I've been eating big money. <laughs> well, can't complain. <laughs> yes. All right, keep All it up, right. eh? All right. Good job. Good job. So, as I was saying, it's crazy, man. Man, it was like a split second staying at the whole thing. I can't really shut up. I said shut up and get out. Let me for my boss, boss. Get out! Please! Christopher! What the hell? What insolence! So it has come to this. You are the one who left a standing order that this thing should harass me each time I come here? As soon as they told the thing, sir, was a Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Hello, darling. Well, and I am shocked. That is a warning. This guy here is my man. And I have a 24 hour uninterrupted access to him. Do you stand between him and I again? I don't care. Get out. Ah, um. uh, I gotta go. Includes warming your office tables and sofas. Are you okay? I can't remember complaining of any of it. Please, 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 Christabel, I need you to respect my dignity as a decent man in my office. <laughs> a decent Casanova. <laughs> well, let's call it the destruction because that is not why I'm here. So, now, Prince Will goes around town in this guise just to escape my notice? I don't understand. Tom, 
How do you even run this company of yours? I mean, this company that your father gave you. Do you ever understand anything? Dummy, you were seen yesterday in a taxi roaming around town to escape my being noticed. Christabel, I took a cab after the armed robbers attacked me. Oh, armed robbers attacked you. Oh. What dumb armed robbers spared your life? They should have blown you to bits to save innocent women from excruciating heart tortures. Jesus Christ, what, 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 what has come over you? you? You should have been happy that I was spared and, and you think I am stupid. Isn't it? You think that I am stupid? That is what you think, that I'm stupid. I saw you yesterday in a taxi with the queue, smooshing. Deny it. Listen, girl, you got it all wrong. You got the picture wrong. Listen, let me tell you the truth. I saw that innocent girl stranded on the road. I gave her a ride, and after that, I'm rubber struck. And yes, go on. You saw a stranded sister on the road. You had to give her a ride in your car, which eventually turned to a taxi. She put her legs on your lap. Doing what I need. Go on. Talk to the food. Mm. Ah. What's up, girl? Hey. Hi, girl. Madam, listen to your friend. <laughs> it's in Kiru. She has started again. I'm telling you. <laughs> Nkiru, if that girl doesn't watch it in this town, I will blot her out, I swear. My sister, what did she do? Funny enough, I was just talking to her as I was coming in. She was telling me some weird story about robbers, stopping them on the way, and a snake saving her boyfriend from the robbers. I don't understand it. But sister, I beg, if you tell me what you should do, I'll feel you later. Okay. Did you just be say, Nkiru, they fish for stormy weather. And her boat will soon hit the rocks. I don't understand that parable. I better break her down. Kira and I were at the supermarket. We met this man. We got talking. He gave me his complimentary card. Then what happened? What did I hear yesterday? In Kiru and the guy are dating. <laughs> oh. Did you see this dating with your own eyes? I don't understand. Girl. I suppose take my eyes to them before I believe. They were seen all around town. In fact, at a fast food restaurant, holding hands. Obviously, they are started dating. How could he be so dumb and stupid? How? All the talk oh, in this house is all about men. Eh? Cool. Can't we have a decent discussion in this house? I know you won't like my line of reasoning. But it's the fact. Come to think of it, I don't see what Nkiru did as out of place. If you meet a guy and he finds favor in your friend, then you back oh, out. Please, 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 this is out of my sight. This born again thing is driving you nuts. Kate! All I know is that any first relationship hits the rock even before it started. Would you stay out of this? Would you stay out of this? This ain't a Bible class! I'm proud of being a born again anyway. Will you leave me alone? Would you leave me alone, Kate? Vivian, when you see your friend, tell her she has stepped on my toe real bad. And I will make life miserable for her. I swear I will. Well, I'm off to church. What I don't understand is a snake. I don't just understand it. The snake. Why 
are you behaving like this now? That snake is God sent. If you were a born again Christian, you'd have gone to church to give your testimony. Look, it's not about being born again, Vivian. It's not about the robbers or the snake. This is all about me. Me. How do you mean? Ah, girl, I've been using robbers to go steal car. I'm not joking. Don't vex. Yes. But really, where could that snake have come from? Where did this snake come from? Hmm? Do you know what we are going to do? Let's drive back to the robbery scene. When we get there, we're going to shout out its name. Whose name? The snake, of course. Then when it reappears, we'll ask him where it emerged from. Nonsense. No vex. No vex. I mean, we'll talk about another thing. I'll be. Hey. I almost forgot to. Gold is breathing fire. About what? Ah. She said you snatched her boyfriend. Some guy both of you met in the supermarket. Does she think I'm as jobless as she is? I beg no mind the girl, Jerry. Guy I give you complimentary card. Now you come and say you be your man. Can you beat that? Just ignore her. Honestly speaking, Vivian, I have not set my eyes on Tunde ever since Gold and I met him. Not until yesterday, when I went to a restaurant to buy snacks. What time? No, tell me, what time do I have for any other? I don't have time for any man. I'm in love with Prince Will. Eh? You know when they say love is blind? I'm blind. I love him with all my body, heart and soul. So tell me where I will not have time for one, one, one Sunday that I have not set eyes on since. You know what will happen? I think I will come back when she gets back so that we can trust this one for all. See, just leave it to me. Leave that girl to me, eh? I will give her the dressing down of her life. Trust me now. You know your girl. I don't know talk about better thing you will show. Chop. I don't diet. No, since I don't have this. Ha 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 I'm going to now. I will come. Oh, come on, come on. You can't do this to me. Look, look, I explained all that I passed through today. All I expected you to do was to hold me throughout the night and try as much as possible to calm my emotional trauma down. Listen, okay, okay. If you insist that you must go, why don't you wait for Mike no. to come? No, no, no. No trauma is above Jesus. Is a sincere invitation. Please, Will. I really, I really think you should give your life to Christ. What are you trying to say? I hope you're not trying to dodge spending the night with me today here. Yeah. Me? Spend the night with you? I cannot spend the night with you even in your house. Talk as if a friend's house. Baby, I have to, I have to go to church. Are you not tired of prayers? Huh? You, you should just allow this man to concentrate and listen to other people's prayers too. Are you making jest of God? Listen, God is omnipotent. He is omnipresent. He can listen to everyone at the same time in different places. What is wrong with you? Sweetheart, I am not making jest of God. I am only to make it to understand. Listen, the Bible tells me to pray ceaselessly. I am living. So that you can also pray here. You don't stop me from praying. Not even in the States. Can't say that again. <laughs> Let me tell you something. You see, amongst all the girls that I've dated, or I'm dating right now, Ifoma is the most reserved. That's what I call a woman of virtue. Take my advice. Move with her flow. You know what I mean? You know? So what are you or where are you driving at? Come on, she got all the qualities, you know? So just hook up. Stick to this one. I like this one. No, yeah. You see, I'm still navigating. When I'm convinced, 
that I found the right person. Amen. I'll bet. <laughs> 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 Mike is gonna scheme me alive. Do you know I'm supposed to have an appointment with him, with the um, U.S. ambassador? What's about your time? It's about three. Jesus Christ! God, I'm late. I have to rush back to the office. Okay, so let's go back together now. No, 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 sit down. Listen, stay back. Prepare lunch, okay? Listen, by the time I'll be back, lunch will be ready. Come on. Okay. Oh my! <laughs> <laughs> Hey, open the gate. Jesus. How did you get in here? What a question. About 45 minutes ago, I saw you in my fiance's car. <laughs> well, like the good girl that I am, I turned my car, rushed down to this place to be sure that you were coming here. <laughs> and like true to my predictions, here you are. Well, naturally, when would have thought that I would have? But then, good reason prevailed on me and I said to myself, instead of a row, why not talk to this girl? Who knows? She could be sensible. I don't understand what you're blabbing about. <laughs> well, let me take my time and put you in a better perspective. <laughs> I'm sorry I do not have such time. I want to go get busy now in the kitchen for my man. What blazing arrogance! What impudence! Are you please, 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 please. Prince Will is not at home. But if you wish to wait for him, I would not stop you. You are a raving lunatic to talk to me that way. Now, let me be more explicit here. If I ever, I mean, ever see you in this house again, I swear I will kill you. You will kill me. Honestly, you are an idiot. What? What? What do you want to do? You want to slap me? What? On your on your life. What is it? Can you believe that stupid, non-entity, low-life impudence? Well, I don't need to blab because I have made myself clear to her. If I see her anywhere near you again, she will be in the middle of a blazing furnace and she will surely roast her life. <laughs> Listen. Please, can I have a word with you in the bedroom? Do not have a word with me and don't touch me. Now, just go into your kitchen and ask that idiot to leave now. Okay. 
Just calm down. I'm going to do that right now. Fine. I'm even tired of this. I have told her to leave me alone and she wouldn't listen. Just just calm down. I will do what you say. Okay? to know about a dog like you whose fly gets excited even for a lunatic on the streets? Well, there is a flaw that you have refused to grab. Fire! You don't see the fire that surrounds you, do you? Fire? What fire? Me. Look, I am the fire that you are too dumb to see. But even if you cannot see it, can't you feel it? I've told you times without number. Stop issuing threats sporadically. It's not ladylike. <laughs> My prince will. How in this world would you have toyed with the idea of using and dumping me? Girl, am I crazy? <laughs> am I crazy to use and dump you? Girl, what happens to what I feel for you? Such my heart. What I feel for you is true. Believe me. Prince Will. So you think I am one of those rats that you confuse and brainwash? Come on. It's unfortunate you don't understand. I've told you, you are my number one woman. Okay? And if I don't feel for I've given you my heart. I've also given you my house key. Stop! Prince Will, just stop! Look, I have told you severally that I am not a kid. Hey, you're so unfortunate that you don't want to believe me. Tell me. I've told you. I will never do anything to bring you down. Tell me. How many women do you have in your life? Hey girl, come on. It's only a matter of time for the tree to shed its leaves at dry season. Very soon all these women that you see around me they go off. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if you say so. 
but just tell that thing that if I ever see her close to you in any form, any form, that I will kill her. Listen, I know this is a necessary job. I told you to take care of things. Don't feel the priest will. The priest will please just do her hard that favor. I didn't call to speak with you. I guess I will have to show you a bit of how bitter the peer is. Christabel, I would advise you to stop wasting your time. I'm the one that Prince Will loves. And I'm sure he won't have time for you. Leave my man alone! I said leave him alone! Don't you get that? What he's doing now is just to suck the juice and drop the chef in the bean. And you... Idiot. What? What is it? Honey? Honey, what is it? Why are you shouting? Who were you screaming at? Talk to me, what is it? Oh, you. Damn you! What's up? Yeah, I'm just coming back from the airport. I've dropped the tiger at the airport. Yeah, she's going to Abuja. She'll be there, let's say, um, two weeks or something. Yes, I am driving to Mkiru's place now to pick her up. Hey, don't say. The tiger wiped off her number from my phone. Yes. Then I'll pick you up later then. All right, bro. All right. Yeah, man. <laughs> Bye. Oh, 
はい、おはようまうんうんあたこにこんすすんでいなおはようまいす So what do you have for lunch? Mmm, <laughs> that's good. Mmm, -hmm. baby, nice. That's good. When you see a good food, you see a good woman. Oh, you yeah. know, this explains, this to show the kind of you know, big quality woman that you are. Mm -hmm. You are more than other women. Mm -hmm. How many women have you told us? Huh? No, tell me the truth. No, 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 no. It don't matter how many women is told that. The important thing is, what is the level of sincerity? I mean, to the women he's told that too. We're saying the same thing. Only God knows how many times he's told Christopher the same thing. Oh, now you break my heart. <laughs> Christopher is not here. He's talking to you, baby. The apple of his eyes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look, Michael, you're alien to this old thing. This is not the United States of America. In Nigeria here, the men, they think that they are so, so... Oh, oh no, 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 no. You're getting it all wrong. Let me tell you something you don't know about men. We all got one thing in common. We all have the same freaking character. <laughs> all men are the same, yeah. baby. <laughs> we love. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, 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 by the way, isn't Cindy supposed to be here? Yeah. Oh, so you're just remembering that Cindy's supposed to be here? Ah, oh. Who shows that you're not serious? Oh, no, 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 not like that. Mike is very serious. See, yeah. because of that, he is relocating completely yeah. to Nigeria yeah. because of Cindy. Mm -hmm. Mr. Frenzo, so you're now Mr. Michael's advocate? Yeah, now you mentioned an um, advocate. That reminds me, I have the mind of suing your company next month. Amazon Bank? Exactly. That's what I mean. I made to them for over five months now. They have not paid me a dime. All I hear is come next month, come next hey, month, hey, come hey, next hey, month. Hey, come, hey, next come month. on, man. Not over the table. If you got money problems, go to the bank and sort it all out. Man, <laughs> come on. Charity begins at home, okay? She's the administrative. <coughs> oh, there you go. <coughs> hey, hey, hey. 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 That's what you get for you know talking business of a table. I was going to talk business <sighs> Good for you. The first requirement of, of table manners is you don't talk while eating. Oh. What school did you learn that from? Oh. I think I was the CEO company. <laughs> hey guys, are you okay? Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. <coughs> Thanks. To ever leave me. Come on, girl, you sound so funny. How can you say that? Come on, I can't leave you then. <laughs> no, you won't understand. You won't understand. There's something about me. There's a problem about me I've been trying to solve. See, listen, every problem has a solution. Okay? If only you can say it, solution will elude you. Just say it. I'm all ears. You see, I hate anger and fear. And I've been trying to avoid that for years. Very good. Every normal human being should despise anger. But for fear, it comes once in a while. It's natural. Do you know why I need you to stay with me for life? Why? <laughs> Why? Because 
You make me so happy. With you, I can never get angry. Oh, no, that's good to hear. Because you <laughs> make happy for life. <laughs> <laughs> oh, girl, I have to rush and pick my girl. Mm. Yeah. He's, he's waiting now, you know. We're supposed to be clubbing tonight. Hope Mike is going to come with few girls this time around. Hey, come on, from the way you're sounding. I'm beginning to think that you're the one preventing Cindy from dating my friend Mike. Oh, mm -hmm. you know that's not true. So, what is the problem then? So, why is Cindy avoiding my friend? Okay. Mike is handsome. Mm -hmm. He's great. Mm -hmm. He has good colors. Above all, he stays in the state. Every woman's dream. Oh. Do you know the truth? Uh -huh. <laughs> Cindy does not want any Yankee guy that will just come, use her, <clears throat> and dump her the next thing. Why are you me like that? Have I said anything extraordinary? I'm beginning to, th I'm beginning to think that you're wacko. I'm wacko. Yeah. I'm wacko. Yeah. I'm wacko. <laughs> <laughs> Tonight, 
you will see me in a form you have never seen before. But that is after I have shown that whore how to keep her legs close to other ladies' men. Men with kid gloves, and that makes them devil on wings. It will never happen with me here. Never. That girl sounds dangerous. I suggest you call the cops. You know what I mean? Just call the cops. For you, very Carlos. <laughs> I love Prince Will so much. I have never loved any man the way I love him. I love him differently. You must get him off your mind. Have you heard? Look, some men are meant to come and go. Maybe he's one of such. I wonder why Prince Will will treat me the way he did. I wonder. On one condition that you stop all this crime. Have you heard? If you don't stop our woman. Hmm?
Let's do it in the human way. Physically. Please. Please.